What's up, YouTube? This video is brought to you by Webull. If you'd like to help out the channel and get two free stocks, make sure you check out the link below. Hey, I'm Chris saying if you're new here, I make videos on personal finance, how to invest and build wealth through the stock market. And today's video is about five monthly dividend stocks I'm buying right now. Without further ado, let's hop into my portfolio and let's do what we do. As you can see, my portfolio is currently sitting at 28,000 $899.33. Today, we are up over two and a half percent. On the week, we are up almost three percent. On the month, we are up over 15 and a half percent. And if I take you guys three months out, we are up almost 10 percent. Today's video, I'm going to talk to you guys about five monthly dividend stocks I'm buying right now. And I must share with you guys, man, the stock market is very, very disconnected from reality and what's going on in the economy. And so as a result, I personally feel like the stock market is too high. And so I want to let you guys know my strategy and how I invest when the stock market is out of whack. And so, yes, saving money, stacking cash is one method that I do use. But when I don't stack cash, this is what I do. And that's what I'm going to talk to you guys about today with these five monthly dividend stocks. So let's hop right into it. Number one is a ETF that I invest in called SPHD. As you can see, it's currently $35 and 10 cent. It's ticker symbol SPHD. I currently hold and added more shares to this. So I'm currently sitting at 70 shares. If you can see, my average cost is $33.36. Another thing I added was LTC properties. Now this uh, is just a regular individual REIT, but it's currently at ticker symbol to LTC and it's currently at $39.87. My current position on this, I hold 53 shares with an average cost of $33.74. Next up, Prospect Capital, ticker symbol PSEC, is currently $5.46. They did very good on their earnings report. And so as a result, they have shot up a lot since, uh, since the report came out. And as you can see, I currently hold 170 shares of this. And I'll continue to add to my position uh, in this stock as well. Next up, we have Main Street Capital. Ticker symbol main or M-A-I-N is currently sitting at $33.01. I currently hold 30 shares in this. I'm going to buy 20 more shares very soon to get it up to 50. And then I'll let you guys know my full plan for this particular stock. What I have it do for me on my behalf and things like that. And I have next AGNC which is uh, the ticker symbol AGNC, $13.32. As you can see, I currently hold 100 shares in this with the average cost of $13.33. I'll continue to average down in all of these positions. Um, but for right now, because the stock market is so high, I am only investing in monthly dividend stocks as well as I'm only adding to these positions when they are close to my average cost. So listen, it's now time for the question of the day. Today's question comes from Demario and he asks, so how did you get involved in the stock market? Do I have mentors? Great question, great question. I got involved in the stock market several years ago, almost 10 years at this point. And one reason I got involved in the stock market because it was the best way for me to put my money to work. And so I was a former athlete, as you guys know, some of you may not know if you knew here and um, the best way to deploy my dollars and have them work for me and make me passive income was to put it in the stock market. And so uh, years ago, I did a few things in terms of uh, investing my money and the stock market was just the best way for me to see the type of returns that I wanted to see. If you know me, I don't invest in banks, um, but I find great companies like Wells Fargo or AT&T. Um, one day I'm gonna show you guys my portfolio and show you just how I do this. Um, but you um, invest in the certain stocks and then they pay you 
a certain amount annually um, and then they pay you quarterly if it's a quarterly stock and so I've been doing that for years especially in my other accounts and that is one of the reasons uh, that I got involved in investing uh, because it grows my money faster than any other vehicle that I can think of that's out there. Also, as an athlete, you guys know the story, man. Too often times I've seen athletes go broke after their playing careers was over. I said to myself, one way they could have preserved their wealth is by putting it in the stock market. And so, because I practice what I preach and I teach this every day, so if you want coaching, you can sign up at the link below. But um, that's kind of the foundation for me of how all this began listen i make videos like this every week so if you like this one make sure you check out the next one remember most people see the end result very few consider the journey do me a favor don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel make sure you grab some free stock using my link below and i'll see you guys in the next one